Pools and splash pads throughout Albuquerque closed today. Two cases of a contagious parasite found, but not in any city pool. Julian Potas was there as one of them was getting sterilized. Guys, usually the pool is a place where friends and family can rejoice after a hot day in the sun. But as of today, the city of Albuquerque has shut down a dozen pool locations, including splash pads across the city. They're worried about traces of cryptosporidium in their water supply, and they're making sure this is not a danger to anybody else for the rest of the day. So we received notice from the city's environmental health department that they had a laboratory confirmed case of cryptosporidium. It's a disease that causes diarrhea. Kent Vigil with Parks and Recreation wants to make one thing clear for everyone to understand. This was not in our pools, but it was a patron that came to our facilities. They visited our facility and then were diagnosed with crypto. But as a precaution, the aquatic division shut down all of its pools and splash pads. It's not just pools they're cleaning, but everything around it too. It's not just the water, so if someone has it on their hands, it can, they can spread it around. Experts with the Albuquerque Environmental Health Department say it takes time to clean something like this. It is a parasite, and so it can take up to 13 hours. Um, you have to use a high concentration of chlorine. Vigil says it could take longer than that. By shutting down facilities for the day, it gives them the chance to clean all locations thoroughly. All of our facilities operate on a six hour turnover. So basically that means in six hours, all the water in our pool goes through the sand filters. So we, we operate on a, we want to make sure we get through at least two cycles. When we spoke with city officials, they mentioned when pools and other locations would be open for safe use. They mentioned by Friday morning, everything should be business as usual. In Albuquerque, Julian Paras, KOT Action 7 News.